I'm Glenn Murray and I'm here at Peacehaven and Telscombe Football Club just down the road from where I used to play at Brighton Hove Albion to find out how the Premier League Stadium Fund has benefited the football club. We have benefited greatly from the fund. Um, we've had over £100,000 given to us over the last 10 years or so now. Um, the most recent one was for our floodlights. Um, we've had those done about 18 months ago. Um, been absolutely a godsend to us. And the benefit of those floodlights? The actual savings on the cost. As we know, electricity has gone up. At home, mine's gone up three times. Yeah. We're here, it's stayed level. So it's, it's saved us a lot of money soon. Right. It's been good. What does the football club do in the community? And how much does it matter to the locals? The kids are welcome here all the time to come. We have got 20 teams in youth as well. So the kids come along and they come and watch the first team of that play. But not only that, we've also got a school that uses it during the week. So it's extremely important in the local community. Very, very important, yes. Yeah. So we're here because of the, the Premier League floodlight fund and yeah. you've, you've, been, you've got new floodlights, the LED ones. Have you noticed much of a difference with them? They certainly don't need um, any time to warm up. Previously we used to have to turn one pylon on at a time. Um, they sometimes worked, sometimes didn't. It was a nightmare. If these ones are instant, bang, 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 when I want to train, when I need to turn some more lights on, they're instant. Yes, yeah, so it's a very enjoyable um, place to go and watch football. And the lights are definitely better than they were, which, is, which again is good for the club. Last season, we had the bottom corner was just blown, so it was like dark in that corner. And this season, it's like playing a day game. It's just so much better to play football. Times are really tough. We know that for clubs. The simple saving of over a thousand pounds over a course of a season is massive for a club of this size. Without that, they are having to increase the, the fees for people coming through the gate. They're having to ask players to contribute a little bit more in subs. If we can just reduce those bills a little bit through our stadium fund, then hopefully everyone gets a better experience, it's more affordable, we're not turning people away because it's too expensive. And that's what we really want, we want football to be everyone's game. Do you know what, I, I always find it really refreshing coming back to, to, to the non-league scene because it's where I started, it's got a special place in my heart. How important do you think it is that the Premier League invest at all levels of football? I think it's it's imperative. There still are those fairy tale stories where some lads, maybe even out there tonight, can make it all the way from here to the Premier League. And for me, that's what makes football special. Better players want to be here. So we're now playing in more games, more competitions. Crowds are building. We had a Vars game the other weekend and there was over a thousand people here, which was massive for the club and for the community. It's absolutely essential that we support the pyramid. These are genuine community assets. You know, this is a club that has got youth teams, it's got girls teams, hundreds and hundreds of people benefiting from this club every single week. And this is one club of over a thousand across the country that are delivering this week after week after week. So, you know, we love football and we want to invest in it. Without the Premier League Stadium Fund, we wouldn't be the level we are at football. They've been brilliant. We've got a great team, we've got a great club now, good support. I just think we'll just continue growing the way we are. I think for me, it's more we're enjoying it. We're happy and everybody seems to be happy around us. Thank you.